Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to 2022 NRL Grand Final between the Penrith Panthers and the Parramatta Eels. Clint Gutherson leading the boys down the tunnel. We can see Wonga Blake, we can see Mitchell Moses, and there we see the captain, co-captain Isaiah Yo of the Penrith Panthers. Such a dominant side once again Hello, in 2022. Fantastic. Let's look at the lineup. Penasini in his first grand final. Reed Marnie, you're about to see him in his first grand final as well. And then in the forward pack, Nathan Brown returning to the side on the bench. Jacob Arthur, Ryan Madison, and Oregon Kofusi. And look at the Panthers. Charlie Staines on the wing. Alan May there in the centres. Cleary and Luai in the halves as they run onto the field. you got kick out. Matt Eisenhoof should be Liam Martin, but it looks like Liam Martin has been put onto the bench. An interesting tactic by Ivan Cleary. He obviously won the grand final last Last year, but as we get ready for the Australian anthem, you see a wide shot of the Panthers. They look raw and ready. Such a big pack. In Parramatta, you could say the same thing with players like Junior Paulo and Regan Campbell Gillard. But it is time for kickoff. There's Nathan game. Cleary. We're ready to begin. Nathan Cleary kicks down the ball. He goes kicks long. it downfield, and it goes to Mitchell Moses. Junior Paulo runs, gets a good run. Runs 30 metres on the first tackle. Parramatta, what a nice play. Reed Marnie goes to run, shifts it left. Nathan Brown's first touch in three months. Two tackles gone for the Parramatta Eels. A 40 metre gain. Marnie is sat down by the Panthers. Now Gutherson, Isaiah Papali'i, Mitchell Moses tries to get through. He got it away to Wonga Blake, but he was tackled on four. Just Bailey Simonson goes back to Marnie. Nathan Brown trying to go through the middle, creating space for Regan Campbell Gillard, who can't get through. It's going to be fifth tackle for the Parramatta Eels. They're going to be just about the halfway line. It's going to be Isaiah Papali'i who puts in a kick. He's going to go up for it, but the Panthers come up with it. It's a nice set from the Parramatta Reel to start the game. And the kick goes about 10 to 15 metres. Dylan Edwards gets an offload to Isaiah Yo. Two tackles gone for the Penrith Panthers and 10 minutes gone in the match. And they get an offload. It goes to Fisher Harris. He's tackled. A few players offside. Very lucky not to get a penalty as Parramatta knocked the ball dead, but... It is a six more, and the Panthers get six more tackles just under halfway. Both teams, the intensity is really, really there. Happy Chorus out to play this one. We've got a few players offside from Parramatta here, trying to get an offload, but Talamay brought down second tackle. And Mitchell Moses rushes to get back on side as Parramatta come up with it via Bailey Simonson. Big error there for the Panthers. Could this be a game-changing moment? Campbell Gillard, Dylan Brown, creates space. Dylan Brown's through. Still running. Dylan Brown brought down. Brought down 28 metres out from their line. Reed Marnie tries to dummy. Mitchell Moses, Isaiah Papali'i, and Bailey Simonson eventually brought down on third tackle. So it's Wonga Blake to play it for Parramatta. Junior Paulo, Regan Campbell Gillard. Dylan Brown, he looked dangerous early on. Four tackles gone for the Parramatta Eels. 22 metres out, almost knocked on by Marnie. It's not six more, it's still fifth. This is the last, they need a good kick here. They're about 18 metres out. It's going to be Dylan Brown this time. And the kick is too big. It goes dead in goal, it's going to be a seven tackle set. The Penrith Panthers, not the play that Parramatta were hoping for and definitely not what Dylan Brown was hoping for as Liam Martin says, sit down, Will Penasini. Parramatta struggling to get back on side. They go out to the wing. Stephen Crichton, Stephen Crichton, what a nice run by Stephen Crichton, obviously on the wing, but playing in the centres. Isaiah Yo, Martin brings it up to 40 metres out, only second tackle. This is much better. This is the Panthers that we know. Nathan Cleary, he offloads it to Junior Paulo, Parramatta. That scramble defence is coming up, not with points, but with some great plays. Now Mitchell Moses to play it. 
He runs a bit. He can't dummy it, and he's tackled and brought down just over halfway. Three tackles gone. Reed Marnie, Junior Paulo, and the Panthers say, sit down. Reed Marnie again. Mitchell Moses, Isaiah Papali'i, Bailey Simonson. A lot happening with those players there. Gets a lot of ball from Papali'i to Bailey Simonson. And it's fifth tackle. They decide to run it. But they get an offload away to Sean Lane, but they are going to be brought down Parramatta. Nine minutes out from half time. Penrith Panthers zero. Parramatta Eels zero. And Isaiah Papali'i drags Nathan Cleary back. Or it may have been Jerome Luai. Reed Marnie tries to get the ball, but Parramatta defending. 34 minutes gone. We're almost at half time. No score yet. As the Jerome Luai gets an offload. Nice run, Jerome Luai. 42 metres out for the Panthers. Three tackles gone. They'll want to score before half time. It'll give them a bit of confidence as Charlie Staines is away. He's brought down. It's a great tackle by Clint Gutherson. He gets a few metres. Well, Parramatta need to be at their best here because his fifth tackle, there's three minutes on the clock. The Panthers have to put in a bit of a chip and chase. Short kick, force a drop out. They put in a big kick and Parramatta knock it on. But Dylan Edwards, it's knocked back. Dylan Edwards comes up with it. So Parramatta, it's almost half time. They're going to get the ball here. You're going to hold on to the ball as we head into the sheds. It is nil-nil in the grand final. 45 to 55% possession. No tries scored in this game to the Panthers. At the moment, on top in regards to possession. Spencer Linu plays it to Coruscant. Fisher-Harris has a run. It's a nice run. Now it goes to Cleary. Tries to put in a pass. He got it away to Eisenhoof, who got really nice post-contact metres. He carried about six metres after he was tackled. And Stephen Crichton once again is through, and he passes, and Campbell Gillard comes up with the ball. Parramatta, that scramble defence, and the effort's working, and the Panthers sit down. Absolutely sit down, Will Penasini. Dylan Brown has been very involved in this game, especially early on. They need to give him more ball. Mitchell Moses. A Papali'i. But no, it's intercepted. It's Talon May. Intercepted by Talon May. What a play for the Panthers reading that one. A few players offside. It's intercepted by Parramatta. Parramatta are away. Reading Campbell Gillard. He steps one. Passes it to Nathan Brown. Runs 30 metres. And 35 metres out. First tackle for the Parramatta Eels. What a scoring opportunity here. Moses, the he's brought down 32 metres out. Reed Marnie to play it. It goes to Nathan Brown. Now to Dylan Brown. Dylan Brown's through. Dylan Brown's through. And his third tackle for the Parramatta Reels. They're just eight metres out here. And they shift it to the right, but they brought down Junior Paulo. Clint Gutherson to play the ball. Fourth tackle, 0-0. Clint Gutherson is sat down at his fifth tackle for Parramatta here. What are they going to do on fifth here? Reed Marnie. Reed Marnie scores the first try of the grand final. Oh, yes. Straight up under the post. Reed Marnie. No one was ready for him there. And Reed Marnie takes that try scoring opportunity, turns it into a four pointer. They play the ball. Caught Fisher Harris off guard. And Parramatta lead the Panthers four points, points to ball. nil. Mitchell Moses to convert from straight in front and the goal. That's conversion Parramatta. successful. Parramatta six, Penrith nil. So 55 minutes gone in the match. Penrith wouldn't think about short kickoff just yet, but maybe later. And now it's Clint Gutherson. And Clint Gutherson, nice run. About 20 metres gain there. Dylan Brown, he's been so dangerous in this game. So 6-0 to the Eels. We're almost into the final 20 minutes. Mitchell Moses. Isaiah Papali'i. Reed Marnie to play the ball. Will he go left? He will go left. It goes to Nathan Brown. Campbell Gillard knocked on. Knocked on by Parramatta. As they approach the halfway line. They give possession back to the Penrith Panthers 
after leading 6-0. Well, let's see if Penrith's attack can click. And Dylan Edwards is brought down by Dylan Brown, the Dillons. Now Happy Chorus out. He shifts it right. Nathan Cleary, I think he tried to put in a kick. Two tackles gone for the Panthers. Appy Chorus out at the line. Parramatta holding on for dear life. They are leading 6 0. But the Penrith Panthers attack. They give it to kick out. Kick out scores. We're going to be all tied up in a moment. Parramatta 6. Penrith 4. Billy Army kick out. The short ball. All he had to do, catch the pass. He caught Mitchell Moses off guard. A and Nathan Cleary and the has a chance to get us and all tied up in, in the 62nd minute of the 2022 it Grand Final. And he does. It's and six points to six. I like what I'm seeing Parramatta have sides, blown that six-point lead. And it's now six all. So tight and Moses to kick us off, get us back underway. Parramatta will want to pin Penrith down in their own end as much as possible. They know how dangerous this team can be. And Moses Leota, what a run. Parramatta has gone to sleep. 35 metre run for Moses Leota. 65 minutes gone in the match. Jerome Luai gets it away to go. Dylan Edwards through the middle. Reed Marnie comes up with it. Huge play by Reed Marnie. He fends off two. He got the intercept. And Parramatta, 36 metres out, puts in a pass. Papali'i, that right-hand side has been so dangerous, and so is Dylan Brown. Oh, almost knocked on, but Junior Paulo, he's tackled on third tackle. 68 minutes gone, Parramatta 6, Penrith 6, they go to the middle. Dylan Brown, nice pass, but Sean Lane is brought down on fourth. So Will Penasini to play it. Just Will Penasini goes left. Hill. Support Caught for Sebo, but he can't get it away. Hill. Fifth tackle. 71st minute of the game. Penrith six. Parramatta six. Micah Sebo plays it. Runs it on fifth. He is brought down. The Penrith Panthers. They're ready. They're ready to pounce. And look at this. Viliami kick out goes straight through. Massive tackle by Clint Gutherson, but not after. A nice run from Kikau, a few run metres there. Junior Paulo and Isaiah Papali'i. It takes two to bring Moses Leota to the ground as they shift to Staines. 75 minutes gone, only one of these sides will win. Parramatta 6, Penrith 6. Linu, Leota. Forward in the tackle. It's in the 77th minute now. Penrith are pressing. Viliami Kikau, he has been very, very dangerous for these Penrith Panthers today. It's fifth tackle. There's three minutes left in the grand final. And Jerome Luai puts in a kick. It goes down to Sebo. The Parramatta are going to get about three opportunities before this game goes to Golden Point. This is going to be the last of Parramatta. Penasini offloads. Penrith come up with it, but it is... Full time at six all. So it will go to extra time. Nathan Cleary kicks off in extra time. And it goes down to Gutherson. And Gutherson says, sit down one, sit down two. And kick out brings him down. Great run there to start Parramatta's momentum. Mitchell Moses, he gets through. Mitchell Moses, great run. Moses away. But he's brought down 28 metres out. Parramatta 6, Penrith 6. We are in extra time, not golden point. Dylan Brown, they can't get the ball across to Sevo, the try-scoring machine in Micah Sevo. He tries every time he gets the ball. Reed Marnie, he shifts it to the middle, Paulo, Moses, offload, Papalihi, Simonson, Simonson scores, Parramatta have taken the lead, 10 points to 6, the Penrith Panthers will have to do it the hard way, in extra time to level it up, go to Golden Point, but Bailey Simonson, Gives Parramatta the edge, 10 points to 6 in the first two minutes of extra time. And Mitchell Moses to convert. And he has got it straight through the post. It's Parramatta 12, Penrith Panthers 6. Nathan Cleary 
He's not worried. He's calm. He's composed. You know what his side's capable of. So Nathan Cleary kicks it back to Parramatta. And the Penrith Panthers are going to need to defend for their life. And here's Clint Gutherson again. Ryan Madison onto the field. On for Nathan Brown. Reed Marnie. Moses. Papali'i. They've been so dangerous on that right edge. That combination of Moses, Papali'i and Simonson. Who obviously gave them the lead. And Parramatta shift it left. They can't get through once again. Penrith have done a great job at containing Will Penasini. And Mike Acevo, Sean Lane, Madison, Marnie Sue, Reed Marnie couldn't get a pass. We are at 83 minutes. And Clint Gutherson, he goes left. He looked like he was going to go right. That was a really nice play by Clint Gutherson to decoy there. Reed Marnie puts in a pass. Dylan Brown, Dylan Brown's through. He puts in a pass to Sean Lane, but it is fifth tackle. And Parramatta. I'm going to hand the ball back to Penrith. Kick out. 84 minutes gone. If the Eels can hold on for five more minutes, they will lift that trophy. Well, there is 20 seconds left in the first bit of extra time, and kick out is going to be brought down, and that is going to bring an end, I believe. No, there's one play left for the Panthers, and Parramatta. Parramatta have five Stubbo minutes to defend for their the life. Let's find out who gets the ball first. Parramatta going to kick off. Penrith, a great opportunity. All right, so it is Leota starting us off. Nice run. Moses Leota. And now it's Luai. Matt who fought down. Two tackles gone for the Panthers, and Junior Paulo comes off for Oregon Kafusi. He's had a huge stint playing 85 minutes, Junior Paulo. Now Nathan Cleary, Nathan Cleary gets through, but he's brought down by Reed Marnie. 30 metres out for the Panthers, fourth tackle. They're down 12 points to six. Now they're 20 metres out. They're going to need to do something special Lua. here. Jerome Lua kicks it kick. into the in goal. Clint Gutherson, he is dragged oh, back in goal. What a defensive well side there for the Panthers. And still three minutes to go. Anything can happen. Mitchell Moses said, boys, let's do this. He drops out and he kicks it back to the 40. Martin and the Panthers via Liam there. Martin comes onto the field. So Martin kick on, Linu, kick out, Penrith 6, Parramatta 12, and 3 minutes east. to go, Mesmerite Dylan Edwards the dummy Mesmerite. and run, the play by that tackle. just 2 minutes left in this game, Almost to the line. And Parramatta the can so smell good. the grand final, but they the need to pass. defend Penrith kick here, out. here's kick Driving out, forward. this is 5th, 5th the last, strong. Fifth to last, a minute and a half to go. Eight metres out. Kick put in by Luai. Cover defence from Wonga Blake, who is brought back in goals once again. So one set for the Panthers to send this game into Golden Point. Mitchell Moses says, we got this. He kicks it to the 35. They pass it. Crichton. Leota, the final minute of the 2022 Grand Final. Penrith Panthers, 22 metres out. Kick out, brought down. Penrith, 12 metres out. This is probably their last two plays here. They're tackled. There's 30 seconds remaining. Dylan Edwards to play it. Coruscant, they're brought down. It's the 48 second. This is the last play of the game. Penrith Panthers at the line. Parramatta! It's taken 36 years, but this club has shown that they can defend in 2022. And defending they did. Right down to the siren. It's Parramatta 20. No, it's not. It's Parramatta 12. But to the, the end, Penrith Panthers the 6. Bailey Simonson with a match-winning try. 
We'll see Jerome Dewey, Clint Gutherson shakes his hand, and Gutho, the co-captain, lifts the trophy for the Parramatta Eels to break the drought. But the Clive Churchill medalist is Reid Marnie for this game. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys tomorrow for my 2022 Grand Final Vlog.